Happy Sunday my friends, back with another review video, reviewing another sauce today. And no, it's not the uh, spicy fire chicken sauce that melted my face off, um, although this is extremely delicious. If you remember when I reviewed this sauce in a previous video, um, I picked up two of these and it's going to take me a while to get to the second bottle, so I am giving this one away. So Omri, I hope you are watching. You were my 100th subscriber, so look for this coming in the mail to you very soon. I hope you enjoy it. Today we are reviewing Tio Frank's New Mexican style green chili sauce. I also picked up a red uh, off their website. I am going to use this, or at least I have ideas of using this for a smothered burrito, so maybe a future video with that one. But today we are going to review the green chili sauce from Tio Frank's. This was a recommendation from my boy Michael Shuck out in the OC. Um, strongly recommended this, so I'm going to give it a try today. Uh, I also grabbed the business card that came uh, with the sauces because it's so quaint and refreshing. Um, and as part of me wants to help them with some branding, part of me doesn't want to ruin the fact that these are artisans making small batch um, sauces. This is a small batch sauce. Uh, you can tell it's it's handcrafted. They're not being manufactured in a huge production facility. This is a, a small family operation. And on the card, Frank, the proprietor, leaves his email address and it is at comcast.net. I, I just find that <laughs> really refreshing um, that, he, that he's not even using that at tofranks.com email address. Like they are focused on, on the food. So uh, small business down in New Mexico. I will link their info up in the description if you want to check them out. But today we're going to give this a try. So New Mexican style green chili sauce, hot. Uh, there's also a mild that they offer uh, made in New Mexico. Not a lot of information um, on the label itself. Um, it just says serve for quick enchiladas or add to your favorite recipes. No real uh, description. So we're gonna describe it ourselves here. Mm. I mean right off the bat you get that very familiar green chili flavor very uh, full and thick. You can tell these were, were roasted. Uh, you see lots of flecks of, of black kind of burnt skin that, that stuck around. I've got the seeds in there. Um, it looks like maybe a carrot. Uh, there's some orange in there. I'm not sure what else is in there. Maybe the ingredients say. Not really. Um, Man, yeah, it's very limited. So we're gonna give this a try just, just straight up. Uh, and then I'm gonna try some with some chips. It, it smells absolutely amazing. Um, geez. If you've ever walked past uh, a barrel of green chilies being smoked at an open air market, like this, this smell brings back a lot of those, those memories. So let's give this a try. Very clean tasting. Wow. Nice hot spice to it. It's quite delayed. Um, when you when you first taste it, you get an overwhelming sense of just freshly roasted green chili. And then a couple seconds later, you, you get a punch to the face with some, some good heat. But not overwhelming that you can't actually um, taste the chili. It's, it's very well balanced. Mm, absolutely delicious with the chips. I think with the chips it's even better. The sauce on its own, it kind of begs for a little bit of salt, but with a slightly salty tortilla chip, this is just perfection on a chip. Mm, really delicious sauce. Nice heat, but not again, not overpowering. Um, I think I've mentioned in previous videos, sometimes you can get a hot sauce and all you taste is the heat and you can't enjoy the actual flavors. This is very nicely balanced with a good level of spice, but really allows you to enjoy a freshly roasted green chili. 
I'm excited to try the red one. Again, I have plans for using this over a smothered burrito. I think this would be amazing on eggs. Uh, it's great as, as a dip for, for chips. Check it out. Tio Frank's New Mexican style, handcrafted by an artisan food maker down in New Mexico. Support small businesses. Fantastic sauce. Michael, thank you for the recommendation. Omri, keep an eye out for your uh, fire chicken sauce. And we will see you in the next video. Enjoy your Sunday, my friends. Peace. Mmm, so good.